everybody. This is Albert Chaplin. I want to thank you for joining us. Whoa! Did you hear that? My mom used to say, quote scriptures when you're scared. You ain't gonna walk through the valley? <laughs> okay. You all know we're just playing around. But the truth is, sometimes things in life do really get you a little nervous and even scared. I want you to check out this video and we'll talk more in a moment. But this question of fear, we're all afraid of it. And there are things in relationship to this fear that you and I have to recognize. That if you trust in God and let Him be your guide and strength, you won't have that fear. And your fear is in relationship to your trust. As your faith in God gets stronger, your fear dissipates. And as your faith in God gets weaker, your fear arises. You want to have fear dissipated and removed? Then you rise up and hold up the name of the living God and look to Him to undertake for you, and He will. It's our faith that brings victory. It's our faith that casts out fear and enables us to put our trust in the blessed Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. We will worship the man of Galilee who went to a cross 2,000 years ago. And no one can take his place. No one will intercede or interfere. We will not permit it. And so it is we have faith without fear. Wow, that really was a powerful video. Short but it got right to the point. Fear can be replaced with faith. I recently had this revelation that belief incubates faith and that faith inspires action and action changes the world. You see, when we can get rid of fear and replace it with faith, God can do great things in our lives. Yea, though I walk through the valley in the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for his rod and staff comforts me. You know that scripture. And remember, God didn't give you and I the spirit of fear. Not at all. But here's why I want to just remind you, that if you put your trust in God, if you truly believe, you can develop your faith. Remember, it's only through God that you and I can make it. At the beginning... You know that this is a green screen and we're having fun with a fire and everything. But the truth of the matter is, sometimes in life, you really do find situations that can incubate fear. But I'm here to tell you, it's through God's faith that you can get rid of fear. And the more and more we walk by faith, the lighter of our burdens are. And I just want to share this with you also, and that God loves you so much. He's bigger than anything that the enemy will ever throw at you. God bless you, and thank you for tuning in to the Albert Chapman Morning Show. Remember, it's all about being born again. It's all about being real with God, and it's definitely about being committed. God bless you, and I hope to see you next week. Wait, I think I hear something else.